There's something about hunting this bushy-tailed little critter that is dear to my heart. The squirrel may not seem like much, but squirrel hunting was probably everyone's first hunting experience. Squirrel hunting teaches you how to master the very basics in woodsmanship. Some of my earliest memories as a child was me waiting for my dad to come home from squirrel hunting and then digging in his bag to look for the squirrels that he had harvested for the day. I've been squirrel hunting for over 25 years, but it never gets old. All right, guys, small game opener. 2022 we are in the woods and the strategy for us today is we're just gonna sit tight and there's a bunch of oaks and hickory nuts around here so we're just gonna sit tight wait for the morning to come alive wait for the squirrels to come out and uh, as you can hear it's raining a little bit so hopefully it doesn't rain too hard but supposed to be a chance of thunderstorm this afternoon so we're gonna give it a good go this morning and then uh, if it starts to get a downpour if it starts to rain too much we'll call it a day but excited for the opener the hunting season is here so stay tuned first squirrel thought I had the GoPro going but didn't so I'm not we'll see. In the tail but the first gray squirrel the okay. there you go I'm not scared good job I hear one over there barking so we're gonna head that way. See if we can find it. First squirrel of 2022. It's starting to rain a little bit again. So we'll keep at it. Hopefully we can get a couple more. All right, first squirrel going in the bag. Keep the tradition going. Got it. All right. He's in there. All right. Let's go get another one. Man, he saw one, but I was still peeing, so I missed it. Could have got two. Too loud. Too loud. All right, guys. It's about 10 o'clock. And we met up with the rest of the guys. How'd you guys do? Good? Yeah. This is squirrel right here. Nice. Yeah. Got three. Take that guy out. Kind of slow year. I don't know if uh, I don't know if it's the weather. I mean, you guys saw like six of them. You guys didn't get a shot at, right? So there's so they're still around. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six squirrels for the day for the morning. Here we are, 2022. Some squirrels. Wow, six squirtles, 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 squirtles. All right, quick lunch. Got some sandwiches, chips, jerky, rice, 
That's what it's all about, spending some time with family. That's how we do it out in the woods. Hmm. All right, guys, we just had a quick lunch and um, we got six squirrels for the group, but we don't know what's going on. So uh, it was kind of slow this morning. So we're gonna head back out. Strategy is gonna be the same, just take it slow. We're, gonna, we're just gonna go and try and find where they're kind of hanging out. Good acorn hickory nuts or whatever and then just kind of hang out but yeah this is what it's all about yeah we're gonna get some more some more squirrels hopefully we get more squirrels i was gonna tell them that but yeah finally back out on the hunt with my dad my two boys this afternoon so nice to spend some time together he was the one that taught me everything about hunting took me out when i was little boy and now i'm teaching it to my boys but that's what it's all about so just spending time together so we're gonna spend this afternoon again taking it slow hopefully we run to some more squirrels all right guys quick update it's uh, about noon now and you can hear some squirrels in the background But it gets uh, it gets a little bit slower. I hear some people, Daddy. Yeah, me too. The afternoon hours get a little slow, and so you have to kind of sit, you know, just kind of sit tight, take it easy, and use a call with like kind of like this lemongrass. It's a distress call, and it kind of mimics a young squirrel being caught by a predator and it kind of it draws in the adult squirrels either that or it gets some barking like kind of what that squirrel up there is doing see up the hill there we just gotta sit tight until it shows up. It's really neat. There's one up there, there's one over there. What? You hear it? Listen. See? Oh, what? Oh, oh, the part? Up there and over there. Oh. Yeah. Alright. about 1 30 now and super slow just like anything else like fishing hunting is kind of the same when it gets to like the noon hours um, everything just slows way down and then it picks back up at about 3 to 4 p.m to 5 p.m so but yeah um, that's kind of the update slow afternoon right now hopefully when it gets to about 3 or 4 p.m., the squirrel, will, the action will start to pick up again. And we'll get something on camera for you guys. We had a few, a couple down the valley. 
that uh, just were not giving me a shot. They were just constantly moving, I guess that's all. I think uh, this evening, hopefully I can see a couple more and get a couple shots before the day's over. Buddy, what's going on? I have another one. Another one? Is, is Kevin shooting them? I think so. There's something behind us. <gasps> Kevin! Oh, it's Kevin. He's walking towards us. And we got another one. Cut. Two reds. Two red really squirrels. One. This is the one I'm flicking. Don't usually shoot red squirrels, but. These guys have been pestering me all day. So we're taking a couple and we'll try them out, see what Kevin, they taste like. Did you get some? All right, guys, it is about 4 p.m. Man, it has been a long day. Whoa, look at this big mama <laughs> fox squirrel. Like the size of a cat. It's the size of a cat. Boy, this, this one is big. Wow. Man, we saw a few squirrels today too, but just didn't get a shot off. We usually do pretty good at this spot, but this, this is why we head off so early is because public land, lots of pressure. I'm surprised there's squirrels every year here, but you know, they... They survive even with all this pressure there's tons of hunters around here but uh yeah this is why we come out kind of a slow year i guess i mean we saw a bunch of squirrels but we just didn't get uh you know too many shots off because the squirrels were always moving so but this is gonna be it nice fox squirrel all right so this is the gang that's left over from this morning and we're gonna call it a day because uh, it got hot it got super hot especially when you're walking around the woods it was kind of sprinkling raining a little bit this morning but the sun is out you can see and it got hot when we were just kind of walking around I'm soaked gotta change but thanks for watching we will see you guys on the next one <laughs>